What's going on everybody? It is your boy Kuda Media and today I will be showcasing Blue Jericho. She's been out for like I believe like three months. Going on to three months now. Don't really know why I didn't upload a showcase video for her before. But recently I've been in the shower, just scrubbing my body, and I've been thinking long and hard. Not because my penis is hard, but because I've been thinking of recording a showcase at the stats I have this blue Jericho at. So this is what the equipment offers her. We got the arm braces, the necklace, the collar, the ring, the earrings, and this ball. I don't know what the ball is, but those are what the stats offer my Blue Jericho. I will be pairing her up with Blue Gila and Blue Melascula in this showcase because they have AoE attacks, and I will be mostly using Jericho's attacks to take out the enemies. I will use the AoEs to just do chip damage on them. I'll use Gila's heal just in case I get low on HP too. So heading into our first match we go against Bon, Gother, and King. So with this set of cards I'm going to be targeting Bon because he has this debuff that he applies on your unit which lowers their attack I believe so Jericho does good damage on Bon I believe Gother or not Gother King is going to do his little heal and remove those debuffs there we go Gother shoots at Bon who then okay his attacks didn't really do much to my units so I don't have any um, Jericho cards at the moment, so I'll just use the other two gals AOE cards. This team name, by the way, is Team Blue Balls because the team is just filled with blue blue cards. And these three units, you know, Jericho, Gila, and Melascula just give me blue balls because they're goddamn fine as fuck, but... I digress, I digress. So King does another heal. He attacks Jericho. I hate that move of his because if it's two starred, then it stones your character. So we will do another AoE, attack him with Jericho's spinning move, and then apply that explosion effect on Gother. So good chip damage. We take out King. And then we take out Gother. 18,000. Pretty, pretty goddamn good damage. So, Merlin hits Jericho, which takes away one of her gouge points, whatever. We will hit her with Melascula's attack. And then another AoE attack from Gila. And finish it off with Jericho's spinning move. I hope not. Nah, this ain't gonna take her out. Look at all those debuffs above Merlin and Jericho. Takes her out like nothing. Low HP and all that. So that was the first PvP match of Blue Jericho. She did pretty good. Sucks that with these other units, um, with their AOE attacks and their heals and all that. Sometimes they just overtake. Jericho's cards. Usually she spawns with two. Sometimes she'll spawn with three. But then once you use those th two cards out like out of your hand the first thing, then you'll probably have to wait another round to get them back. So we do go against Merlin, Gother, and King. We'll hit them with Gila's AoE, then Melascula's, and I will target Gother with Jericho's spinning move. You know, that's good chip damage. That's also good chip damage. 19,000. And we take out most of Gother's health. So King does remove the debuffs. Merlin hits Jericho, takes away one of her gosh points. See that move right there? I think if it's two starred. It um, disables their attack. So cards that have that sword 
you won't be able to use them, but cards with the skull, you will. So I'm gonna hit him with Gila's AoE. Then I'm gonna target Merlin, and see how much this does to her. So we do apply some fire debuffs on them. So 21k. I mean, it is 50, level 53, that Merlin card. But still, 23k on a green unit when you're blue. Pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, I knew King was going to do his heal. So we could get rid of that debuff. So King's almost dead. So I will just... I hope Melaskula could just take him out with that. And I will aim for this chick. I don't know her name. Okay, so Melascula does take out King. 14,000. The arrow is pointing down, meaning it's, you know, dis type disadvantage. When the arrow points up, that means you have the type disadvantage. Yeah, when it points up, that means that's, you know... Type disadvantage if it points down type disadvantage so if I'm a blue and I'm attacking a green you know green beats blue the arrow will point down and when that a unit attacked me green attacking blue it points up and then if it, I think if it's blue uh, attacking blue attacking blue will point across blue attacking red will point up and blue attacking green will point down so that was another good showcase for jericho i ran out of pvp little token things whatever and i do not want to waste a gem so that was my showcase i do love this unit she is pretty damn good at the stats i have her yet at she's pretty damn good at the stats i have her at but she could always get better if you upgrade the jewelry or if you just have other pieces of jewelry. Yeah, she could always get better. She could never get worse because she will always just improve. She's just she's just that unit, you know, that always improves. I usually pair her up with this. This Escanor and then this Meliodas because they all came out at the same time. This Meliodas is a fucking monster. But, yeah, I usually pair her up with those two, and I just have a Melascula on the bench because I, I love that team. You know, Meliodas and Escanor have that AoE effect. And, yeah, well, I hope this was a good showcase for you guys. I'm all over the place because I haven't really recorded any videos in such a while, especially for Grand Cross. I've been playing hella global Grand Cross cross because it came out and i literally just pulled green jericho today and i got her to a ur as fast as i could but that being said um i know i'm waiting to the end of the video to set a like goal but the like goal on this video will be two likes i hope you guys enjoyed if you did please do su consider subscribing to me if you want to see more content in the future but with that being said Wow, I just got a phone call that interrupted my outro. So, yeah. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Look at them titties jiggling. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, jiggle, jiggle. Man, oh, what the? Hey, what's up, baby? All right, well, yeah. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like down below. Goal is two likes, and please do subscribe, consider, consider <laughs> subscribing down below for more of my content. But with that being said, thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys soon.